que God so loved the world. He gave his only begotten son. That whoever believes in him. How's it going, brother? It's getting better. It is what I make it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So tomorrow I'll try to turn in the leaf, you know? Yeah. That should be right now, but try to do it right now, you know? Yeah. Get baptized. Not, not in your own strength. His oh, mercy and grace. Yeah, I got to turn my will over to him, you know? Yeah, yeah. The Bible says, for by grace are we saved by faith. Right. Not of our own selves. Exactly. It's a gift of God, not of works. Our life is worth any man who works. Yeah, yeah. You know, I'm trying to get that up here. I'm more uh -huh. spiritual than religious, but like... Trying, you know? It's a relationship. At the end of the day, Those do you have that relationship? You know, I'm trying to fill that void. So yeah. tomorrow I'm gonna go get baptized. Yeah. Yeah. Just get that eternal. You know, because that's the main key to the eternal kingdom. You know? Before you get baptized tomorrow, just spend some time, quality time, in your closet room alone with God. And anything that you've done in your life, no matter what sin it is, just confess it to Him. Just bring it before Him. Bring it before the cross. Is He ready for my confessions, man? Oh, yes. <laughs> the Bible says that He is more than willing to forgive you and cleanse you of all unrighteousness. That's how merciful God is. You see, when you sin against the devil, He kills you. Yeah, you see these movie stars and actors. The devil's and more strong in the temptation wise. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know? But you know, you got a wonderful God who loves you. He wants. He, does, he doesn't want to see you destroyed. He doesn't want to see you in, in, your, in chains or in bondage. He wants to. He wants to wash you clean. So when you go to that baptism tomorrow, before you get there, just spend some quality time with God. Just confess your sins before Jesus Christ. Just give everything to Him and ask Him to forgive you. And you know, Jesus Christ will come into your life. He will wash away your sins, and you will. You will have that personal relationship with Him. I've been bonded in the worst of places. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, now being out here, I see I've taken too much for granted, man. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's time to just let go and let God do it. You know? I, 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 I totally relate with you. I, you know, I was a porn addict for many years. Shackled, you know? Yeah. I was being shackled and held down. I mean, cold and shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. It's time to just let God deal with it, you know? Yeah. God bless you, Lord. Let me give you something before you go. Let me bless you with something. Just to give you some regulations and living standards. Uh, me and my brother wrote this uh, a few years ago. It's called The Bridge Is Out. Yeah, yeah. It'll, it'll be God bless you. God bless you. Thanks so much. No problem. You take care of yourself. I says, people, the word of the Lord says, for all are sick, every one of us. My name is Steve, and uh, I do evangelism because one day after a con church convention that I was at, when God was really moving and, and God added boldness to, my, to me, and I, I was able to worship God more boldly. And then after the